Peso's medical bag. Look, the clam. Uh, Quasi, I think you mean clowns. Shiver me whiskers. We'll have to search shell by shell. Peso? 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 Ah! Whoa! Try the X-ray viewer. Clam. Clam. Another clam. I can't do it. I can't do it. I can't do it. This game is for this all. Clam. Clam. Peso. Clam. Clam. Peso? Quasi? Are you all right, Peso? Well, it's getting a bit cozy. Look out! We've got to get out of here before we're all clam sandwiches. It's too heavy. We need a... Whale! What? Simon! giant clams before. Ready, Quasi? Aye, Captain. Ready. Ready, Peso? Ready. All right. When I give the command, tickle, pull, leap. Tickle. <laughs> That's it. Now, pull. <laughs> <laughs> leap. <laughs> everyone. Especially you, Simon. Thanks for helping to save me. No problem. Hey, who wants to go back down? We should put the giant clam back where we found him. Oh, I can do it. <laughs> Come on, everyone. Follow me. Hey, wait for me. What's the hurry? Time for an emergency landing. Oh, make that a crash landing. Phew. Huh? Yeah. Um, giant clam, I think you have something that belongs to me, and I'm gonna need it back. In that case, we'll do it the old-fashioned way. <laughs> Hmm. This could take a while. Uh-oh. Sounds like more lightning. And it's heading straight for those manatees. Time to sound the octo Oh. Huh. Oh. Can't uh, quite reach. Aha. A sticky limpet. And a little seaweed. Bullseye. <laughs> Octonauts to the HQ. Octonauts, the lightning storm is heading straight for a herd of manatees. We need to get them to safety. Are you with the manatees now, Captain? Um, not exactly, Peso. I'm sort of, um, stuck. Uh, doing something else at the moment. But I'll guide the mission from here. The lightning storm's picking up speed, Captain. Keep tracking it, Dashy. Everyone, let's move those manatees to deeper water. Captain, wait. Go ahead, Shellyfish. I mean, uh, Shellington. Uh, I mean, Shellington. The manatees breathe air, Captain. 
They can only be underwater for a few minutes before they need to take a breath. So, the manatees will need to be moved somewhere they can breathe. Then we'd better lead them back to the Outropod. The Outropod? I meant to say, get all those manatees inside the Octopod now. Aye, aye, Captain. Octonauts, to the cups. Yow! I'm digging this air today. You said it, ma'am. Nothing beats a little fresh air. Captain, we've arrived on the scene. Good. Then get those manatees moving. Aye, aye, Captain. Junip, come in. Super couple. Junip, the manatees will need something to eat. Gather as much sea grass as you can and bring it to the launch bo- Uh-oh. Super. Uh, nothing to worry about, Tunip. Just get the seagrass. Hmm. Hmm. Hungry barracudas. I'd better make myself invisible. <laughs> hey, <laughs> stop it. <gasps> oh, that tickles. The jelly not only uses its comb to swim, Peso, but also to handle food. Its little tails are tickling you. <laughs> Luckily, you're too big to be eaten. There. Feel better. Later, later. Huh? My medical bag. Ah. Ooh. <laughs> uh. Over here, Captain. Uh, Quasi. Help. Yow! Peso, what are you doing inside that thing? Peso, inside. Inside Jelly's belly. Let him go, you bulbous beast. Wait. Don't hurt him. I'm all right. Mostly. Quasi, how did Peso get in there? Never mind that, Captain. How are we going to get him out? It may be a bit tricky. As you can see, the comb jelly is see-through. But he has several clear layers of skin surrounding a clear stomach full of water. And Peso? Go, go! No! No, go, go! No! Peso? We're trying to work out how to get you free. Stop playing around. But I'm not. Jelly, please stop. Ah! Quasi, Dashy, get the guppe. Shellington, let's go after him. <laughs> Whoa! I got it. I got it. Oh. oh, he got it all right. Dashy, get me close. Closer. I've got you! I've got you! Jelly, <laughs> stop! That's my friend! Quasi cat! Catfish! No, not a catfish! He's a. Oh, never mind! Quasi, are you okay? Just give me whiskers a moment to stop shivering! I've got him, Captain! Oh no! They're being swept away by that current of fast water. This is getting serious. Let's sound the Octo Alert! Octonauts, to the gups! Octonauts, Peso is stuck inside a comb jelly, and the comb jelly is stuck inside a fast-moving current. Oh, my! Oh, no! <gasps> Peso, can you hear me? Peso! It's no good, Captain. I'm just getting steady. Tweak, you stand by. We may need your help. Got it, Cap. And we'll follow that current. Whoa! That was a close one, Quasi. <laughs> oh, the ocean deep is the life for me. Jumping off from board, sailing out to sea on the octopod, just you and me. And a million fish in the deep blue sea. Give me whiskers. Ice avalanche! Turn, turn, turn left! Turn right! There's nowhere to turn. We've got to stop the ship. Now. <gasps> Ten seconds till we hit the ice wall. Oh, ah! Ah! A fast, you beautiful!
cuteness, scurvy octopod, stop! Six seconds till we hit the wall. Five. Hold on. Three, two, one. It's okay. We've stopped. I know, but you're standing on my foot. Oh, sorry. Phew. That was close, mateys. Now what, Captain? If we can't go forward, then we go back the way we came. Ow! Captain, look out! We're trapped. Dashi, sound the Octo Alert. Octonauts, to the HQ. Captain, are we in trouble? Well, Peso, we're trapped here in the freezing cold waters of the Arctic Ocean, surrounded on all sides by ice, with no clear way to escape. So that's a yes, then? Ah, you know, these ice walls are often quite thin. It might be possible to break through one of them. Aye, let me out there in the gut B, Captain. I'll smash that ice to smithereens. Or I could add a drill to the gut D and... Uh-oh. I was afraid this might happen. What might happen, Tweak? We've stopped moving, and it's so cold that ice is clogging the engines, shutting them down. Cutting off all power to the octopod. No good. The ice is too thick. If only I could find a place where the ice is thin. <laughs> 